Yo YouTube, what's up? It's Mr. MW209. Today I'm going to be showing you how to basically install Envision Powerboard version 3.14, no, version 3.1.4 on your own computer without it being on a web host. If you want to test it out, test new mods out, if you create your mods for it, then this is a great uh, thing to do so that you don't uh, mess up your web host first thing you're going to need is WAMP server 2.1D uh, I've got version 64 uh, times 64 because I've got 64 bits so you're going to need this I'll put a link in the description for it um, for 32 and 64 so basically you're going to install it run administrator Next, accept. Next, don't really need a desktop icon. Let's give that a second. couple of more seconds should be done just press open if that comes up it just goes off I just press ok uh, next after this and keep that ticked finish and you should see this come down here if you're running Windows 7 it should flash just click it and go put online and it should say online as you can see servers online so what you're going to want to do is go to computer local C disk WAMP you'll see a folder there called WAMP click on it click on the www one and if you go to your web browser now and type in Oh shit. Type in local host. It'll come up with your server configurations. This is the main index page. To get rid of that, you just uh, delete that. So basically, to get Envision Powerboard on it, you're going to want to uh, drag the upload folder off your Envision Powerboard. Uh, and drag it to your desktop. Once you've done that, close it off. Open up your uh, folder, highlight them all, and drag them into the www folder. Once you've done that, you're gonna have to go to config underscore global dot dist. Right click, rename, take the dot dist off, so it's just global. And then um, once you've done that, just go to internet, type in local host forward slash admin forward slash install, and this should come up. Um, just press next, press I agree, um, press next, press next. Um, I think you can just press next. No, no, no. You have to type in localhost for there too. Localhost. And type in for the SQL username, type in root. And then you can, now you can press next. Oh no 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 no! I forgot. Yeah. Type in local host forward slash php my admin, and you're gonna want to need to create a database here on the local host section. So create new database test. Create 
create I have created that database now test now that should work there we go um, you can just type in anything uh, I'll type in uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And there's my um there's my own personal email address. Press next. Start installation. Once you click start installation, it should prepare everything, just leave it until it's finished and then it'll tell you to remove the installation file um, it'll tell you to remove the installation file just go ahead and remove it which the installation file in here is in there in admin install and then just delete the index so just go back and delete the whole installation file or rename it it doesn't really matter you can just leave it there because it's on your own thing nobody else can connect to this give it a few more seconds uh, as you can see it's on 5 out of 13 6 just importing all the templates and the um, XML files for the uh, the main home page and certain tasks now members tasks certain admin languages now shouldn't be much longer few more seconds As you can see, it's on nine out, well, ten out of thirteen, and it's just got little odd things to do, like the help files. Right, uh, it's on twelve now. Hooks now. All hooks inserted after this. There we go. Literally about two seconds. There we go. Proceed. Done. Congratulations, your Envision Power Board node obviously is not ready. Is now ready and no, it's now installed and ready to use. So if you click on that, it'll take you to the main page and you can just click sign in, you can log in, you can type in the details that you um, typed in. There we go, login was successful. Um, you can click up here, log into admin, admin uh, C panel. And then you have to type in the details again. Uh, so it's pretty useful if you're gonna uh, mess around with it. Um, I'll be doing more tutorials on things like this, installing different scripts on your uh, 
on your local host so yeah thanks for watching please subscribe and remember to rate and comment the video and also sign up to my website uh, here it is yeah please sign up um, there's not much on it because I've not long started it I've got 24 members um, I've, there's only 17 posts total but once I get more than 24 members they should uh, rise up like my other sites that I had um, also we've got a sell and buy where you can sign up and sell things basically it's a bit like eBay but it's not eBay but this is um, all owned I own this um, and I would really like it if you could sign up because I do pay the monthly co monthly charges for this website as you can see it's dot com uh, so yeah so please sign up which will uh, there'll be a link in the description and it will help us out a lot um, because then I know I'm not wasting my money uh, for buying a domain. So yeah, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, rate, comment on the video.